please welcome Adriana Ruvalcaba delivering greetings on behalf of our MSW graduating class. Buenas noches. Buenas noches to interim Dean Jacquard, Associate Dean Martin, esteemed faculty and staff, family and friends, and of course, to the graduating class of 2017. I am honored and humbled to address all of you today on behalf of NYU's Silver MSW Class of 2017 and none other than NYC's Radio City Music Hall. So how did we all get here? Well, I for one took the one train down. It was crowded with Columbia grads and the humidity didn't help either. So I hope everybody else had a much smoother commute in or better yet, you were able to afford like a cab or an Uber something that as graduate students don't have the luxury um, or the privilege just yet. Speaking of the environment and privilege, we as social workers know that we are all a product of our environment and nothing happens in a vacuum. Coming to the field of social work did not happen out of the blue for me. It was all part of my lived experiences and the people who surrounded me. I must admit that I had myself a stigma towards social work and what it meant. Well, ignorance is bliss. When I began to explore just what this field entails and all it offered me and those around me, it was like opening up Pandora's box. The values that come with this field are very special and unique. Our desire to make a difference in the world by addressing oppression and social injustices might be corny and cliche, but it is the true core of our field. These values are a product of those who inspire us. So thank you to the families, loved ones, and friends here today for being our inspiration. And to my parents who came here with nothing but a dream and believed and encouraged me when I needed it the most, gracias de todo corazón. This is why this field means so much to me the possibilities it grants me to continue to challenge the status quo and fight the good fight, especially in these trying times, are truly endless. Part of me struggled to find the right words to express what social work truly meant to me. So as the great Cesar Chavez once said, you are never strong enough that you don't need help. With that being said, I enlisted some of my closest social work colleagues who have influenced me and my experience here at NYU to share what this field means to them. Here are their words. I was tired of being angry all the time about all the ways the world was screwed up and unfair. Social work has taught me to channel that rage into love and action. Social work is social justice. It means equity, empathy, leadership, and love. I didn't choose social work, it chose me and I feel privileged to be a voice for the silence. To me, social work means listening and hearing more than just the silence, speaking up when nobody wants to say a word, and seeing in others what they fail to see in themselves. Social work gives me the opportunity to heal the wounds and trauma of those who the system set up to fail. Social work is more important than ever in this social political climate. It's who we are at the forefront of making a difference. Nothing moves until we do. Discrimination, hate, oppression, and pain are static from the sidelines. Through social work, I've become part of many pushing forward towards that change. I have felt like a social worker long before I knew it was a profession. The call to action and responsibility to the most vulnerable made it the natural choice. To be a social worker is to fight for all my ancestors have sacrificed. My hope is that these words have inspired you as much as they have inspired me. So to my fellow graduates, mark today in your memory bank because this is your day in history. NYU Silver will never be the same now that you have passed through its doors and neither will you. 
Hold on to your passion because the world depends on it. P.S. Black Lives Matter. No ban, no wall, and love always wins. Thank you and congratulations.